I'm gonna feed the ducks. I need the bad cam right now. Welcome back, honey. I'm going to feed the ducks. I'm going to hurry up a little bit because I don't have unlimited bedroom power. I'm using my arm. I don't need a selfie stick because I have my arm. Now we're switching to the back cam. It's the dots. That's me calling them. They have many ducks here, honey. Do this. Yeah. I'm talking to my friends. These guys are my friends. They like me, I like them.
Okay, I'm back. I uh, clicked the wrong button when I was changing the camera. What I'm gonna use now. Let's see if I can use. Get a good camera angle here. It says here viewers. I don't know if you stopped watching, honey. Know what I got home for? Maybe it's possible. You know. Look, this duck is beautiful. I'll change the back camera. This is bread, and these are ducks. And that's a pawn. This is a pawn. Here we go. These these ducks are beautiful. If you look at the big one there. Hello. They have a couple of ducks. You see the big one over there. And I've seen that big one with another big duck. They might be a different breed. I don't know. Or if it's the same breed as the other ducks, only it's older and it's gotten very big. But uh, I hope he's... I think that might be a woman. There used to be a couple. So that big duck over there used to have another big duck and they would walk together like a couple. So I think that they, uh, there might be another breed. This is the duck for me. I really should have the background music, Feeding the Ducks. StreamYard has a background song you can use called Feeding the Ducks. That, that would be like the perfect moment for that. Uh, because that's what I'm doing. Actually, let's do that. <laughs> let's, I'll try. Just a second. So I'm going to be feeding the ducks live using StreamYard while playing the song called Feeding the Ducks in the StreamYard free music order library. They have five to ten songs, free songs that you can use as background music. And this one is called Feeding the Ducks.
Okay, I'm back. Yeah, so I seem to have spooked him a little bit. Once I charged up, there was a duck over there by the tree. And I was going to do a long throw. And I uh, did like a baseball throw. And these big movements look aggressive to them. So they got they got spooked. <coughs> we'll do this one. This. Get a spin on it to stabilize the projectile in flight. There you go. Let's get that one over there. See, they're coming up of the water now. They're coming out of the woodwork. Ducks look, they look cute when they're walking. They wobble back and forth. They have these birds too. Sometimes they will uh, get bold and they will swoop in when you're feeding these other ducks. These will do dive bombing tactics where they will go in and they will uh, pick something up from the ground. They will snatch it before the ducks can get to it. Seagulls. I'm going to give them all of this. This was cheap, two dollars for this whole pack, I think. There's a crow there. I get some to the crow there. Oh, he got spooked. Two left. You're gonna have to get bold. Corpus, corpus. Hey. See, there's a seagull swooping in. These are ducks. Yeah, they're cute. It says zero viewers. I don't know if that's gold spanning or uh, sometimes YouTube people write me a message to watch my live stream and then I have zero viewers at the same time. I don't know if it's gold spanning or if we had to go. But it says uh, zero viewers right now. Gotta throw this plastic here. I'll give you this 360 here.
Thank you. And it still says zero views right now. I'm going to screenshot. It says zero views right now. But I had this person write just a minute ago. And we just wrote a few seconds ago. But it's been saying zero views the whole time. Let's see. That's a crow over there. Right there. This is a place where people like to walk the dogs and people will jog here. It's a field. I can go here, I can look at the ducks while they're in water. So this is where they usually hang out. And they just hang out around here and they stay ready because there are people who will come here like I did and throw bread to them. So they like to hang out close to the uh, land here. I mean, they could be on the other side over there. But this is where people go to feed them. So they like to stay pretty close here. And then uh, if somebody comes like me, like I did today, they will hurry up and go get the bread. But this is the home, the duck's home. They spend more time in water than they do on land, I think. And now they're coming over here because they're, they're thinking that maybe this human standing there is going to throw more bread to us from where it's right now. They look at humans as a potential source of food because they've been fed bread from humans so many times. It's an association to the mind. It's like uh, first time a duck sees a human, they might be scared to run away from the human. But then it's like uh, they see the human and then food starts running down. And then there's an association. Human equals food. And then... <laughs> And uh, not killing me. Like they haven't seen humans jumping through water and biting the heads off the duck bodies, because then they would have, <laughs> then they would stay away from humans. But they've seen humans throw bread to them many times, so they look at humans as a source of food, not the human body itself. But food comes from the human. It's a blue sky today. Only we had some clouds. But mostly a blue sky. And that's probably a seagull over there. It sticks to itself. Over there. And uh, the water over there looks a little bit perturbed, a little bit different. I don't know if it's ice. I can't see. Yeah, it's ice. It's frozen over there. There's a thin coating of ice on top of the water over there. That hasn't melted yet. At first I thought it might be that it's like troubled water. That the wind or the current are a certain way over there. And uh, it's making the water surface be a little bit different but i look close and i can see no it's ice it's static nothing's moving so that's a thin coating of ice over there you're not allowed to fish here they have a sign somewhere like no fishing i think it's there no fishing allowed if not you could get a pole here you could fish I've seen your comments, honey, but I'm not putting it up on screen because now I'm doing a natural geographic type video shooting. So if I put it up on screen, maybe I want to look at this later and I want every de I want detailed. I want it to be detailed. And if I put this up, it kind of ruins the picture. There's something on screen obscuring the view.
Thank you, babe. I thought about you, and I thought you might like if I go film the ducks. That's not the only reason I did. I like feeding the ducks, too. But before I decided to go and feed the ducks, I thought, that's something that we like to watch. Thank you, babe. Yeah, it's pretty beautiful. Now, here the ducks are again. There's some of them that's still on land. Maybe they're looking for some uh, breadcrumbs or something. They might be left over. That guy is nuts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them. See if I can get close to them without them running away. <laughs> I like these ducks. A lot of times the ducks are lazy. Those ones, they flew. Like a lot of time when I see the ducks here, if they get a little bit spooked, they will, they will walk away and into the water only faster. Like they will walk. They prefer to walk. They don't like to fly unless it's necessary. Like most of the time when ducks fly, it's either because they're going to like Africa, whatever they go in the winter. <laughs> or uh, like to change the location, to move somewhere else. Let's go to... Uh, the neighboring town I live in the pond over there for some for some time. Or if they're spooked and they need to get away from a threat. Fight flight mode. So if I move too quickly towards these guys, some of them might fly away and some of them might uh, walk away. So let's test that. Yeah, you see? Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so if they feel like something's a danger, potential danger, then they will fly. But most of the time, they prefer not to fly, and they will transport themselves on foot, duck foot. They will walk when they need to go somewhere. But if they need to move quickly, they will fly. Seagulls. Yeah, it's been good vibes. The duck feeding, that's a strong good vibes type content, definitely. There's a little pork. And they play football here sometimes.